Ah, uh, weddings. A time for joy, love, togetherness, and going tits up on the dance floor. No, don't do it. This is a bad idea. I love how confident she is, whereas he knows they're going down. Yeah, full Titanic. This is good. This is my jam. He's doing a safe, achievable set of dance moves, and everyone loves it. He knows there's no need to overdo it. God damn it. Here's a traditional church wedding. This bloke is like, Oi, wait for me. I'm not in position. Now now I am. I was just practicing my footloose dance moves for later on. I meant to do this. It was intentional. It's always good to know who you're marrying, but if you don't know, it can still turn out alright. This fella is a bit nervous unboxing his missus. It's all good though. He's a satisfied customer. The celebrant is thinking, are you fucking serious? You've never seen her before? The groom says, yeah I have. I'm just happy she showed up. The staff members you hire can make or break the day. I reckon these guys are trustworthy. Worthy. The cake is getting a little wobbly. Oh, he catches it with his face. Good dedication. They dodge a chair, shuffle to the left. Another face catch. He locks in his teeth. This cake is going nowhere. Actually, gravity says, fuck you, give me that thing. Dear me, what a mess. They present it like nothing happened. Grandma is circling. Oh, I'll have this piece. Ten second rule. It's all good. Yum. Speaking of cake, this Sheila slices a piece for her hubby. She says, welcome to the family, dickhead. He's like, gee, Wiz, you think you know somebody? I never knew you were a food fighty person. People should get to know each other before they get married. He sees a chance for revenge, but it's a balls up. The whole cake is wasted. Everyone laughs merrily. Ha ha ha. Hashtag first world problems. I don't know. If I was a guest at one of these weddings, I'd feel awkward about witnessing domestic violence. We don't need to know that you like it rough. Yeah, nah, yeah, she's fucked. Till cake fight do we part. Three, two, one, divorce. Yep, destination divorced. Who brings a catapult to a wedding? Is this a jaded ex-boyfriend? Oh no, it's the bouquet. The Sheilas are running after the flowers. Look at all the women that want to get married. Oh, we've got a fall, two falls. The lady in red thinks about helping, but she goes, fuck it, now's not the time. This is about my life. This woman at the back is in no hurry. She's happy to get married when her boyfriend's ready. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. This is almost as exciting as that cheese rolling festival. Here comes another big fight. Oh, nah, no one gives a toss. Fair enough. And same here. These guys treat the bouquet like it's a fucking grenade. Animals and weddings are the greatest. This dog says, I piss on your eternal love. He cheated on you and you don't even know it. I saw it. The other dog says, mate, don't be so cynical. Anti-love dog replies, they cut out my balls. How do I not be cynical? Meanwhile, back over on the dance floor, creepy old Uncle Terry is in the house. He is out to hashtag me too, as many guests as possible. He gets away with it in the workplace, so why not try it at a family celebration? Classic. Rubbing your genitals on people after a dozen drinks. Classic wedding activity. Overall, the best weddings are the ones you'll never remember. This guy is having the time of his life. He has devolved to the point his mother-in-law has to feed him. Brilliant. Absolutely fair dinkum brilliant. Brilliant.